What is up everybody? It's your buddy Cruzamoto. Today we are going to be getting rid of the OEM tail light and we're going to be installing the TST Industries integrated tail light for the MT-09. All right, everybody, welcome back. So in the package, you're gonna get your headlight. Oh, it's your tail light, my bad. It's, I said headlight because it looks just like the headlights with the eyeballs. It's kind of neat how they mimicked it up there. Um, then you're gonna have your resistors or whatever they are. I'm not gonna use them because that just stops them from flashing super fast and you got a little bit of hardware here. That's about it. But uh, super, super easy to install this. All you gotta do is take off your seat. We'll get to that and undo a few bolts. Pops off, pop the new one in, plug and play. That's the coolest part about TST Industries. It's all plug and play, everything. Comes with instructions, so follow them. Let's get to it. All right, everybody, here we go. So first things first, gotta remove the seat. So if you remember, keyhole down here at the bottom, underneath the bike, kind of a weird spot. I figured it, I wish it was like this FZ07 where it was on the side, but it is what it is. So you're gonna take off your whole seat, okay? Set that bad boy off to the side, and then, the fun begins, folks, okay? It's not too much, you don't have to pull a ton of stuff off this bike, so it's kind of cool, okay? So, one, you're gonna need your Allen key, of course, and you're gonna take off here. You're gonna take out this bolt. So the next thing you guys are going to be taking off is going to be these bolts here and right here, okay? This is so that you can get access to stuff underneath it and everything too, okay? So you got to take off these, these bolts here. Now this is for the lock, you know, I want to check and double check, make sure that this has to actually come off. I know this has to come off for when you do the fender eliminator. So let's see if it has to for the light, which I don't think so. So I'm just going to unbolt these two bolts here and then I think this is where all my connections are right here under this little uh, cover right here so we're gonna go ahead and do that Like I said, I like TST Industries stuff, man, because it's all plug and play. They make it super, super, super easy, man. You know, literally, that's what plug and play means. It means plug it in and freaking go. Here, undo your Velcro. Get in here, and you got your... Let's see. Let's see what we got here. I'm just gonna undo these so I know I got the right ones going on here. Okay. Uh, let's see. This is looks like it's stuck in a little thing here. Let's see. That's probably why this needs to come off. But again, not that big deal. I probably can get it off without it. You know. So um, yeah, we're gonna have to take off those two. Let's see here. Yeah, it's popped down in a little thing down here. I can get my screwdriver, pop it up. Go ahead and get this down in here. Pop this thing out, man. It's just a little pin it's sitting into in here. So that way it doesn't come out. If there's a way to pop it out from underneath. 
Oh yeah, this is one of those. I gotta get some pliers, squish it. Twerk it, baby. There we go. All right, so there's that. Whole thing should pop right on out, okay? Wham bam, thank you ma'am, okay? So that's that. Now, for the other turn signals, I don't need them. So we're gonna, we'll get into that because they're gonna plug in, in here, uh, the ones that come on the integrated. So like I said, plug and play. I gotta take off these bad boys, but I'm gonna do that after I at least hook up the new tail light. All right, so here we go with the new tail light. I'm gonna run the cables through here like it was. Okay. Back down through here. Come on. Get in there, go to your home. Go to your home. Get in there. Hey, come on. All right, get in there. You were, you went in, you came out so easy. Come on. Shit. Man. All right, so there's that, there's that. Let's get this freaking thing down where it needs to be. Right. This is probably why that thing needs to come off, but like I said, you can do this without doing all that mess. This ain't, this ain't that bad, so. No. Ah, come on, man. What are you even hung up on in here? Oh, a zip tie. Stupid. All right, here we go. There. All right, so. <laughs> Ooh, come on, get back on there. Get on there. Okay, so it looks like these are gonna pop out. You're not gonna need these, okay? Yep, it looks like you're not gonna need them. Okay, at least got that on there. So what you guys are gonna do, of course, remember, plug in, okay? Everything's plug and play, all right? Now, check your directions, because it will tell you which one of these, or you can just check, you know? It's not gonna hurt it on which one you get, so you wanna see if you got the right one, do one first, okay? Plug one in, turn your bike on. Oh, well, don't turn it on, but turn the power on, okay? And then hit your blinker. See if it's the right one. All right, so it's not the left blinker that it's plugged into. All right, click right, that's on the left. Okay, so this one needs to go into the other plug. Okay, so that way when you do the right one, you're good to go. So that's super fast, easy process of elimination, you know, of how easy this is to do. So now when I do left, Left blinkers on, I do right, right blinkers on. Okay, that's it. And you know, hit the brake, comes on, we're good. So that is basically how you install your TST integrated tail light on your MT-09. Um, like I said, I'm keeping everything off because I'm doing the fender eliminator and I need to get to all that other stuff that's right there anyway. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Super, super easy. I'll show you guys what the tail light does and everything at the end when I'm all done putting everything back together. I will do a video of what the tail light looks like because it is programmable too. So I'm gonna have to look into that and see what they mean by programmable and see what it does. All right? All right, everybody, here we are, we're back. I'm gonna show you guys what I meant by this tail light being programmable. Um, right up underneath, right on top of here, if you can get your pinky back in there, there's a little button in there you're gonna be pressing. So you wanna take your seat off so you can get to it, of course. Turn your bike on, okay? Now this is Normal brake light, I hope that's not blinding the shit out of you guys. Probably is. Um, but here's a blinker, left blinker. Okay, that's how we got that. And now for programming, how you wanna do it, get in here and press the button. 
see how it changes get it set to how you want it there's different ones um, for the brakes okay like you do that press it again because the brake can uh, toggle like it should flash a bunch too there's all these different modes see like that press and hold the brakes and it'll do a strobe okay and you just keep going there's like tons of different functions like you can get how you get the brake light you know going and all right see so now there's a strobe effect for the blinker and uh, you know for that that's pretty cool huh you just keep going through there's different ones you know like I said it will go through the different brake functions and stuff too and into the signal so once it's like that it means it's moving on to the next one okay so this is probably what I'm gonna keep it on I like it the fact that it flashes like that um, alerts people so um, that's how you program this bad boy okay so if you guys get one of these you can do that you can set up it actually has like ones where it does different stuff it has like eight different programs on it through the brake lights how the brake lights work and the uh, and the uh, blinkers too so it's pretty cool so that's it for that everybody all right later